Grammar Two for Level Two Students, Chapter Thirteen: Gerund and Infinitives, Verb Plus Infinitive. Some verbs are followed by an infinitive. An infinitive is to plus the simple form of a verb. See the examples. I decide to stay at home. This verb is followed by an infinitive to stay. And here we see to is followed by the simple form of a verb. Similarly, they expect to see their friends. So this verb is followed by an infinitive, which is to plus the simple form of a verb. You forgot to tell me your name. This is the infinitive. And in the sentence, he promised not to smoke again. To smoke is the infinitive. Verb plus gerund or infinitive. Some verbs are followed by either a gerund or an infinitive. They have the same meaning. See these examples. It began raining. In this sentence, this is the ing form of the verb, and it is a noun, so it is called a gerund. In the second sentence, it began to rain. In this sentence, the verb is followed by an infinitive, where to plus the simple form of the verb is present. The second pair. You started watching the movie. In this sentence, watch the ing form of the verb is watching. It is a gerund. The same sentence is written here. You started to watch the movie. This verb is followed by an infinitive to plus the present form of the verb watch. Preposition plus gerund. A preposition is followed by a gerund, not an infinitive. See the examples. Ali insisted on playing football. Here, this preposition is followed by a gerund. There is no infinitive here, and we cannot use an infinitive. The preposition should be followed by a gerund. He thanked for inviting him. We apologized for making a noise. All these are gerund, the ing form of the verb. Those are acting like nouns. You dream about building your career. And this is the gerund also.